We get it. Not everyone wants to create all of their recalls from scratch. While it is the best practice to write your recalls in your own words, maybe you're too busy and sometimes need a shortcut. Now, I Do Recall enables you to import flashcards from other sources and convert those imported third-party flashcards into recalls. There are many great sources of flashcards on the web, and I'm going to show you how to do this using two of the most popular sources, Quizlet and Anki. Here we are at Quizlet. You can import flashcard sets from your Quizlet account or search for and import any one of the hundreds of millions of publicly shared flashcard sets. As a simple example, let's say that you want to import a set of cards about U.S. presidents. First, let's export this set from Quizlet. It has images on the cards. I'll click to include the image links. Then click to copy the data to your clipboard. Now over at I Do Recall, let's import those flashcards and convert them into recalls. Paste your clipboard contents from Quizlet here. We suggest adding a tag or two to identify the imported set, or better yet, use tags to associate it with one of your courses. Let's pretend that I have an American history course and I want to include these imports with the recalls from that course. Now I'll complete the import. You can see them in my recalls list, and here I'll search for the ones I just imported using a tag search. Let's check out a few of them. Next, I'll show you how to import flashcards from Anki. If you're an Anki user, you probably know that you can import publicly shared decks from Anki Web. Once you have a deck imported or a self-created deck in your copy of Anki, you have several options for exporting. But we have some limitations with Anki. You can only import text flashcards without images or audio. To do this, select Export from the File menu and then export the file. Open this TXT file and copy the text. Then paste it into the I Do Recall Import page. Add a tag or two if you'd like. You will notice that the text is in HTML. You don't really want literal HTML in your recalls, so opt for conversion of the HTML to plain text. There are many other third-party sources of flashcards which you can import into I Do Recall. You can even upload TXT and CSV files so long as you use tabs to separate the question and answer in the TXT files and commas in the CSVs. Then separate each flashcard in your file with a new line. If you have any trouble importing third-party flashcards from other sources, please contact us for assistance.